DC's crushing the game. Crushing the game. One, two, three, four, five, six. Number six, that's Warren Buffett's number. And that number makes him a supreme baller, one of the biggest of the big steppers, mega large, because Warren Buffett is the sixth richest person on the planet. He has stacks and stacks and stacks and more stacks on top of those stacks that he made just from learning about and investing in the stock market. Now, Warren was born in Nebraska in 1930 and moved to D.C. when his dad was elected to Congress. He went to Alice Steele Junior High School and graduated from Wilson in 1947. And somebody actually wrote in his yearbook, likes math, a future stockbroker. Real talk, Warren bought his first stock when he was just 11 years old. And he hooked his sister up and bought her some too. Everybody who knew Warren knew that he was a really hard worker. Let's see. He worked in his granddad's grocery store. He sold gum. He cashed in his soda bottles. He had a paper route. He sold magazines and he detailed cars. He was always on his grind. When he was a high school senior, he and his friend Don Danley started the Wilson Coin Operated Machine Company. They bought an old pinball machine for $25 and put it in a barber shop. It seems people liked playing pinball while waiting to get their hair cut and business started to grow. He eventually sold that business for a cool $1,200. And look, years later, Warren put that company name on his license plate cover. Warren is one of the most respected and biggest bosses in finance and investing. He's been called the Oracle of Omaha. An oracle is a very wise person. He established his own multi-billion dollar investment firm, and he's worth more than check it, $100 billion. And here's something else. A long time ago, Warren made a pledge to give 99% of his wealth to charitable organizations that help people, that further science, and other important things like that. And because of his monumental generosity, Warren Buffett's been awarded a Presidential Medal of Freedom. Warren Buffett making it rain for everyone. Now that's DC crushing the game. <laughs>